Hello everyone and welcome to another one of my videos. This is Blue Jay Girl and my name is Joanna and I film planner sticker haul videos. They're <laughs> stickers that I've gotten from different sales or other things and I just film little calls of basically how I went crazy during quarantine and bought a junk load of stickers and I decided to share them all with all of you just, you know, to share my happiness with all of you. So uh, let me show you what I got so I can tell you what I think. Today I have four sticker stores here, Planner Kate, which I've shopped at before, Charlotte's Paper Company, which is new to me, uh, Planner Desk, La Petite Paula, which is also new to me, and Magnolia Boulevard, which is not new to me. I've bought a lot of stickers from them. I like them a lot. Same with Planner Kate, I've also bought a lot from them. Anyway, let's get into the haul so I can show you what I got and tell you what I think. First up, let's start with Planner Kate. I love her stuff. Uh, really good for just functional practical stickers. I just keep buying them because they're just really awesome. Uh, okay, so she has a new business card, which I think is really cool. And I know that there's gonna be a discount code on the back, so I'm just gonna put that over here. <laughs> she always gives you a bunch of different functional freebies. So here I got a bunch of label boxes. One has checks. This is a different color palette. These are weather stickers, and then these are weekend stickers. And I love all of her little functional stickers because you can use them for any kit. They're pretty universal. Most of her stickers are pretty universal, which is why I love her store so much. Um, I got the film edit upload stickers. I saw them on, I don't remember whose channel, but someone was using them. And I was like, that's a great idea for when you do your YouTube planning to just have the little words already written out so you don't have to keep writing them out all the time. I also got prescription bottle stickers because I do have medicines that I take on a regular basis for different health things that I have, and these were just a really happy way to remind me of when I need to take what. I got car stickers for car maintenance, because who does not have car maintenance in their lives in some way or another. I also got an assortment of writing cleaning stickers. I got clean bedroom in different fonts and not fonts, colors, and clean office in different colors. I like these fonts a lot. I know so many people love the fancy cursive fonts, but I just prefer something more block that I can read. And Planner Kate is one of the stores where I've been able to find like more block writing. So I really love the idea of just putting these in my planner so I don't have to always like write down all the time. Because sometimes you just want to put something colorful and happy. Also, I have really, really bad handwriting. So I just don't really want to you know, put my handwriting in my book if I can help it. I'm trying to work on it, but I'll, I'd rather have something more legible that I can see and what have you. Anyway, this is my small amount of stickers that I got from Planner Kate. I'll probably order more soon because this is like my third order. Also, I order my budget stickers from her because I've started budgeting thanks to Live Loves to Plan. Um, she's, I started watching her budgeting videos and I really enjoyed all of them. I will link her below, but I like her budget stickers for the PP planner because I don't have a PP planner, but my planner is the same size so I can use those when I'm doing budgeting. Not my planner, my notebook is the same size. Anyway, yeah, really loved all of this. So this is, I love everything I got from Planner Kate. It's really awesome. Her stickers are really great. Next up, I have Magnolia Boulevard. I do enjoy this store. I think this is my second or third order from them. I've ordered a lot from the store. <laughs> really like what she has. Um, she has this really cute Halloween freebie, which is really nice. Um, she was having a sale. I don't remember why, but I got a bunch of full boxes from her for that sale. So I got these kind of Christmas elf, um, the Grinch theme stickers. I also got these nutcracker themed full boxes which I thought were really nice. I got some Luna Lovegood themed full boxes, be not full boxes, deco sheets because um and also the Luna Lovegood washi sheet I guess is what it's called because I got the full boxes and I used half of them but I realized that I liked the color scheme so I wanted the rest of the stickers so I just got them all to go with it. I also got her space, I guess it's a space themed kit deco sheet because I liked the astronauts and I like this and I don't use a lot of the full boxes not full boxes like quarter boxes and half boxes and stuff 
most of the time for my planner because my planner is really small so it doesn't make sense for me to get the bigger ones but I just really liked all of these that I have going on right now Next up, we have La Petite Paula. It was wrapped in this really pretty, I guess, rope. Is rope the right word? Uh, twine. But I had to take it off to take the um, invoice out. So yeah, it was pretty. And they have this handmade with love sticker, which I thought was really cool. And follow me on Instagram, which is really cute, I think. And let's see. So La Petite Paula, gave, I got this little planner flat lay. It's really small, so I thought that was a good size. Also, all of her stickers seem to have her follow me on Instagram La Petite Paula thing on the back, which is really good advertising. Uh, I also got this, I got a bunch of Hobonachi kits, so this one is Pride and Prejudice themed. This one is Summer Dreams themed. really pretty this is i don't know what this was themed i think i thought it looked differently but now i think it's maybe like a baby themed so i'm not sure what i'm gonna do with this and this was a full boxes from a fall kit i believe and i just decided to get the full boxes because i like them but i don't need most of the stuff that's in the kit um, and that's everything i got from there i'm very excited to use the hoba nachi kits and especially like the Pride and Prejudice one because I love Pride and Prejudice. So this is based on the movie, obviously, but still very excited to try out those stickers. And then the last store is Charlotte Paper Company. Okay, she gives you this really cute freebie with a picture of her and her child and stuff on it. Um, then I, really cute stickers though. And I love the personal touch of the picture it's really nice um it kind of makes you you know build a personal connection I guess you could say um and then I got this I think this was a part of the Harry Potter sale um so I think these were Harry Potter themed ones I think this is supposed to be the Weasley's clock um as well and Birdie Bot's themes these were these were fall themed And these were just really cute um, deco stickers that I got, which I liked a lot. These were really cool universe stickers. I think this might have been a kit, a universe kit. And then these were class stickers and work stickers, which I got for when I have to work and when I have class, because I liked the background and the color scheme. I just thought they were really nice. Um, overall, these stickers are beautiful and I cannot wait to use them. And I think they're lovely. And everything I got from this haul was great. Uh, when I'm filming this video, it's the end of August. I want to thank you for watching and I apologize if it's not up to my usual level. I have been very sick with um, gastritis and something that they thought was COVID, but now they're not really sure. And I'm the type of person where I have a lot of other health issues on top of that and I have a sensitivity to medicines and things. So when I have one health issue, it sends to send my other health issues into complications. So. I really wanted to film this video and show you what I got. So time, cause time had already really passed cause I think I ordered these at the beginning of August and it's August 22nd. So I wanted to make sure I was putting the content out there but I'm definitely like not in the best of health right now. And so I apologize if it doesn't have my usual level of enthusiasm or excitement but my body is just like all over the place and I'm just, you know, trying to survive as, as it were. So I hope that you like this. I hope that it was everything that you wanted it to be. And yeah, I hope you really enjoyed it and it was a lot of fun. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up. Uh, please like and subscribe to the video. Uh, if you hear snoring in the background, it is um, other people, <laughs> not me. Uh, but uh, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope you give this video a thumbs up. Um, I hope that you liked it. I hope this video brought you a little bit of joy. I really... You know, I, I know a lot of people who do videos online do them because they're struggling with something and it's an outlet for them. And for me, I don't know, I feel like if I can bring a little happiness and a little joy to someone else, you know, that makes my day. So I really hope this brought you a little happiness and joy and just everything else. Uh, but yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope this brings you joy and happiness and yeah, I'm going to stop 
but oh and check me out on instagram if you want as well but oh 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 anyway oh i'm so off my game thank you have a great day